College football is back in Big Ten country. They love their Spartans here in East Lansing. Michigan State welcomes in-state rival Western Michigan. Opening day at Spartan Stadium, and it comes up now. And we're underway here in East Lansing. Good kick by Muma. All the way down to the goal line. It's Ansel Ponder to bring it back. He is blown up at about the 17-yard line. Play action under pressure is Carter, and he'll go down back at the 11-yard line. Colin Neely came through and got the sack. Four-man rush on third and 14, and Carter sets up the screen. A loss of about eight more. Winchester is dropped inside the five by Chris L. Rucker. Second down and two. The C's part for Baker. He's got a first down. Breaking tackles to the end zone. Touchdown. Seven-yard line. Let's. Bell again. Cuts it back to the right and turns the corner. There goes Bell down the sideline. The true freshman's to midfield and he cuts it back. All the way down inside the 20-yard line before he's finally brought down. It's a corner blitz off the edge. He goes right by him, Toller. And then once Le'Veon Bell gets into the secondary, you see the speed of the 6'2", 230-pound freshman and why the coaches are so excited about him. But good blocking downfield by Martin, getting in the way. Huge momentum shift in this ballgame. Keyshawn Martin. Martin inside the 10. He's knocked out of bounds at the seven-yard line. That's good for another Michigan State first down. Toss. And Baker gets to the five. Baker into the end zone for a touchdown. So it's a great time to run that route. And off to Le'Veon Bell. Touchdown.
touchdown drive. Conroy caps it with the point after, and it's 28 to 7. Michigan State, second and 17 after the intentional grounding. Dell makes the catch. Again, right at the first down marker. And it looks to be good enough for a Michigan State first down. Terrific throw from Cousins. To come back after uh, having an intentional grounding and get a first down on the next play, that's the kind of poise that he's uh, displayed in his career. Trying to turn the corner on the end around is Martin. And there he goes, Keyshawn Martin. Tripped up at the 20-yard line. Last year, Keyshawn Martin averaged 18 yards per tuck. Rubion Bell, outside, no contain once again. Bell's got a touchdown. Too much beef and too much speed from Michigan State offensively, and Western Michigan looks like they uh, are succumbing to that pressure. Third down. Carter up the seam. Intercepted. Picked off by Marcus Hyde. Oh, that's a big game changer for Michigan State. Games of interest in your area coming up as well. All games can be seen on ESPN3.com. And off to Edwin Baker. Breaks a tackle at the 40 and gets all the way out to the 50. Heck of a run by Edwin Baker. And we've seen a few of those today from these Michigan State backs. Yes, I've been impressed with Edwin Baker. He was the fifth guy on the depth chart and had to work his way up and, and earned everything he's gotten at this university. And I think he's a better player because of that, not being given anything, but having to work for every single opportunity he's had. Dan Conroy from 32. He's got it. Three more for Michigan State. And the lead swells to 38 to 14. Spartans on top, midway through the fourth. Here in East Lansing for the Western Michigan timeout. The Broncos line up to go for it on fourth down and a couple from inside the 10. Carter to the end zone, incomplete. Sailed over the head of Jordan White. So once again, our final score. Michigan State 38, Western Michigan 14. For Brian Greasy, I'm Bob Wachusen. And the rest of our crew here in East Lansing, thanks so much for joining us. College Football Scoreboard, presented by Acura, is coming up next. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. Now let's head back to Wendy Nix in our ESPN studios.